everyone. We're going to continue on with our identities and we're going to establish that um, this side, the left side looks like this uh, double angle of tangent. So the first thing I'm going to do is use my common denominator here, which is cosine of theta minus sine of theta times cosine of theta plus sine of theta and fix my numerator by crossing up here. So these two are the same. So that's just going to be cosine of theta plus sine of theta squared minus, same thing's going to happen, but it's cosine of theta minus sine of theta squared. So what we're going to get is use your factoring knowledge. This is the, the numerator is going to be cosine squared of theta plus 2 cosine theta sine of theta plus sine squared of theta minus, uh, I'm going to write it, okay, so we have again, it's cosine squared of theta minus 2 uh, cosine theta sine of theta plus sine squared of theta all over my common denominator. I'll just put my least common denominator here. I'm going to put that there. All right, so now let's clean this up. The numerator is going to be uh, cosine squared of theta plus, I'm going to write this a little smaller. So we have cosine squared of theta plus 2 cosine theta sine theta plus sine squared of theta. Now I'm going to, I'm distributing the negative, so you get negative cosine squared of theta plus 2 cosine theta sine theta minus sine squared of theta. Now my denominator, basically, uh, I'll go ahead and write it again. again. We had um, cosine of theta minus sine of theta times cosine of theta plus cosine of theta whoops, sine of theta. And you should know that this is your a plus b, a minus b, sorry, times a plus b, which equals a squared minus b squared. So cleaning up my numerator, what happens is those cancel, the signs canceled, and I have four of these. I have two here and two here, so that's four cosine of theta, sine of theta, and my denominator is just going to be cosine um, squared of theta minus sine squared of theta. I'm using my a squared minus b squared. Now, if I um, can, what I'm going to do is factor out a 2 here in the numerator because I want to use my double angles, so I know that, and I'm going to flip the sine and the cosine here, because I know this is sine of 2 theta. So this is 2 times sine of 2 theta. Okay, in the denominator, this is your double angle for cosine of 2 theta. Now, since these are the same, uh, double angle sine over cosine is tangent, so we have 2 tan of 2 theta, which is our desired result. Okay? Thank you, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.